Hey guys, how are you? It's Arthi here. I hope you guys are all doing really well. I'm doing great here. We actually got snow over the past week and we're going to be getting a little more snow this weekend, I think, and it's going to be five degrees tonight. So, oh, yippee, that's going to be something to prepare for, but I'll be at work, so it should be fine. Um, so the topic of today's video is going to be flaxseed oil. Because I, you know, I shot a video last week, but I really didn't like it, so I didn't want to upload it. So I figured, you know, why not just wait? I'll just do another video because I wanted to make sure that I didn't forget anything. So, um, so I'm going to talk about the flaxseed oil today, and I actually made a few notes for this video because I wanted to make sure that I didn't forget anything. So let me just, I guess, jump right into it, and we'll start talking about the flaxseed oil and my experience with it. Okay, so the first thing is I'm going to show you the flaxseed oil. So this is it right here. This is from the vitamin shop. I actually bought this for $11.49, which is a great price. And this is um, one of their medium-sized bottles. They have a bottle that's a little bit smaller than this. They have one that's larger. So you can go a little bit bigger with this if you want a little bit more. And... Um, so um, I always go to the vitamin shop to get it, but it's available at Trader Joe's. You can get it at Whole Foods or any other health store. You can even get it probably at GNC. I'm sure they would have it. So um, the reason why I started taking flaxseed oil in the first place was because when I was, actually when I was in my late 30s, I started having inflammation in my joints. And not, you know, it was mostly in my hands. It wasn't anywhere else in my body. And, but I didn't really do anything about it. Just kind of left it. It went on for years because I never occurred to me that it might be like a mild arthritis or anything. So I just neglected it. And then also I had had a dry skin problem that started in my early thirties, which I know I've mentioned in my other videos, but that I just kind of dealt with, didn't really do anything about it. Just kept slapping more lotion onto my face which didn't help all that much but so um it was actually a few months ago that i decided to try fish oil because you hear a lot about fish oil these days so you know i looked it up online and all the reviews were good so i took fish oil gel caps for a while for maybe about three and a half weeks took it twice a day um tried to stick with it but I couldn't because it just would bother my stomach every time I would take it so I just came to the point where I realized that, okay well this is not going to work long term that I need something different because you know I, I can't see myself taking fish oil for months on end so then I went back online to do some more research and I stumbled upon flaxseed oil now of course I've heard about flax seeds because you see it in all the stores so I figured, you know, why not give it a shot because I know it's high in omega-3s and, but you know, the reviews were a little bit mixed on it. Some people say it works well. Some people say it does absolutely nothing, but I was like, okay, well, I don't care. <laughs> I'm just going to go and just buy it and give it a shot. So I started taking it and it did start to help with my inflammation actually like right away within the first two to three days, I noticed that that kind of achy swollen feeling that I had in my joints started to subside and after about a week of taking it it was like almost gone to the point where my hands felt really good like I could move them it didn't hurt as much and my hands felt very comfortable like the way they used to when I was younger and then the next thing is with my hair I guess you know what I'll go in order I'll actually refer to my notes this is probably a good time to do that okay so hair, skin, and nails. So the first thing is with my hair, I saw that after a few days that my hair got shinier, it started to feel softer, and it seems to grow a little longer. Now, longer, faster, like doesn't take as long to grow because, you know, as if, you know, some of you guys are watching this and you're a little older, you'll know that everything slows down when you get older, especially hair growth. So that was the first thing I noticed. Um, the second thing is with my skin, I would look in the mirror and my skin looked very supple and soft and smooth, not because of what I was putting on my face. It was more like there was like a natural moisture coming from the inside out, which is different because I haven't, you know, had skin like that since I was back in my twenties. 
so I mean it really you know you could really notice that there was something going on and even my fine lines on my face were less obvious it just didn't show up as much it kind of diminished that a little bit so but it took a few days for that for my skin to improve I would say it took like a good probably four to five days before I started to see that anything was happening and then with my nails I also noticed that my nails became a little shinier smoother and now they seem to grow faster also because every time I trim my nails they just seem to come back much quicker <laughs> just you know I look at my nails a few days later I'm like wow I didn't I just trim them but they're growing back already so that was another good thing and so I would say you know all in all that the flaxseed oil has done a great job for my hair skin and nails you know I you know I just was really surprised with the results that I got because you know I had heard about it and just I, I was actually kind of iffy before on it before I took it because some of the reviews on it were so negative but I'm actually glad that I took it and I have been sticking with it for quite a while now for a few months and I'm gonna keep taking it and I really do find that it's helping me it's it helps a lot just with even just with the way I look in general you know now I think I don't have to worry so much about the dry skin I don't have to worry about looking so old maybe <laughs> because it's it's really helping I think from the inside out it really is doing something so I wanted to just share that experience with you guys today because I haven't seen a lot of videos on flaxseed oil reviews so I figured you know I might as well make this one so if you're thinking about it you know definitely go out and buy it and give it a try or if you're just curious maybe just get a small bottle of the flaxseed and you know give it a try so um, as far as using it I take two tablespoons of the flaxseed oil per day I take one tablespoon with my breakfast I take one with my dinner I would definitely recommend that you split you know split the dosage take it you know two times a day separately don't take it together because I have tried taking it together with my dinner or breakfast and it's it's a little too much I think it does bother some people's stomachs so I would say just you know do that and you should be okay with it so but and it has a nice flavor it tastes kind of nutty and if you buy it like this in the bottle in an opaque bottle which I would suggest you do it actually um, I think it has like a nice grainy texture too I like the texture of this one because I know Trader Joe's has flaxseed oil but theirs comes in a glass bottle no actually in a dark glass bottle but it's not like this their texture is completely different it's more just like straight oil but this is um this is nice like over a salad or you can just take it straight or you can even mix it into a smoothie or something which it says you can do on the bottle so um so I mean all in all I would say that I would give this like a 10 out of 10 <laughs> or a score of 10 so I really like the flaxseed oil I'm really happy with it so I would definitely recommend this if you're thinking about something if you can't handle fish oil then you know put this on your list as something else to try so but um okay so I think that's it for this video so I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day hope you like the video so I'll be back again soon okay bye